What's up boys, today I'm going to be showing you how to get the headset in GTA 5. Now, if you look at my character right here in this image, it looks fucking sick, doesn't it? Fucking hell, this looks good. One problem, you can't keep it on your character. Now, let me explain what I mean by that. They completely patched it out of the game. You can still have it on your character for a few seconds, and then it's gone again. Now, you can still have some banger photos taken, but that's about all it's good for, photos. If regardless of this, you still want the headset saved in an outfit, maybe they unpatch it someday, these are the steps. Also, it took me like five hours to come up with a way to do this. So, first thing you want to do is go to the airport and borrow yourself a cargo bob. And you're going to want to send Bob a message saying, Sorry mate, can you forgive me this one time please? Before Bob whoops your ass. So you want to take this cargo bob to the casino and that's where we'll be doing the glitch. So the moment you land your cargo bob out the front, you want to call in a car. Make sure it is a car, and it's your personal car. And once you've done that, get your car somewhere open and pick it up with the cargo bob and drop it into this spot right here. Next, you want to somehow dispose of the cargo bob and get on the roof. So I failed to get onto the roof, so I'm just going to call in a heli from Merriweather, and this is an essential step as well. Whether or not you fail to get on the roof, I suggest using this helicopter to perform the glitch. Fuck you, Bob. So now once you've done that, you just want to get back onto the roof and land the heli somewhere safe so you can get back into it again. So from here you want to get to the car and align it perfectly with the edge of this pool right here. Now would be a good time to mention that you cannot have a mask on for this, so you can take the mask off from the accessories menu. And going further down in the style menu, go to auto show aircraft helmet and turn that to on. Make sure you leave this door open. This is done by opening the door and running away. Now get back into the heli, take off and land exactly how I show you here, facing this direction with one of the landing skids in the pool. Now I'll quickly show you why we do this. Because of the way Rockstar patched it, it only removes the headset off your character after a certain amount of time. This means that even when getting into a helicopter, it will remove the headset. So to actually perform the glitch, the way it works is you have to get into the passenger side of the helicopter. Your character will then scoot over to the main pilot's side, and you want to be spamming F to get out as soon as you can. If you get out into the pool when you saw your character had a headset on, then you've probably done it. So now the last step to make sure you do have it is you have to run to your car and get in as soon as possible. If you don't see the headset on your character, you haven't done it and you have to go do it again. Now unfortunately if it doesn't work, that means the helicopter's at a bad angle. If you have an atomizer, you can fix this pretty easily. If you don't, you probably can't fix it. So you just want to slowly swim over to the car and get in as soon as you can. As you can see, my headset is visible there, that means I have it. Now taking your car, you want to line up at the stairs right here and just floor the pedals. Oh my god. I've made a severe and continuous lapse in my judgment. So you want to just drive off of the building. And now that you've landed on the ground, you want to make your way to the mask store without getting out of your vehicle. So now that you've made it to the mask store, you want to make sure that your driver's side door is right next to the prompt to enter. If it is too close, then you'll enter through the passenger side door and you'll fuck the whole thing up. Now the moment you get out of the car, you just want to spam your interact key, which is E on keyboard. And the moment you get into this menu, you can press space to save the outfit. So if you want to get a mask on at the same time, then make sure you save the outfit and you just follow this road to the other side of the pier and you do what I do right here. So you want to run past these little rental binoculars and whilst you're running by press E, your character will turn around but he won't go into the view. Now from here just load the headset outfit, get back into the car the moment you do.
and drive to the mask store. And now that you're here at the mask store, just do the same thing you did before. When you line up the door of the car to the mask store, you get out and you immediately get into the menu. And now you can save the outfit. Alright, that's it for the video. Now scram.